The lead singer of the band Portugal The Man is using her platform to raise awareness for rare diseases. And that's because her daughter was recently diagnosed with one and our Addie Miner sat down with Zoe Manville before the band show at Paris Town Halls Wednesday night. For Zoe Manville and her husband, John Gurley, being on tour with their band, Portugal The Man, is the lifestyle they're used to. But life on the road changed when their daughter, Frances, was diagnosed with a rare genetic disease called DHDDS. Everybody has a DHDDS gene, but hers is not functioning how it should. And so when you have something like that, it something as it sounds simple, like having a misprint, but that changes your biology. Manville says she knew something was wrong when Frances started having small seizures, like this one that she recorded. Her eyes were blinking, um, kind of looked like she was falling asleep. You okay, Frances? And she just snapped right back. So at the time, we didn't even realize that that's what it was. The disease causes symptoms similar to Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease, including seizures, epilepsy, a loss of muscle control, and dementia. Only 70 people around the world have been diagnosed with DHDDS, so there hasn't been much research on what causes it or treatments. Our goal is to change that. We want to keep the research going on this disease. Manville says the band raises awareness for DHDDS and all rare diseases by sharing Francis's story, selling merch, and running a website dedicated to the cause, all in hopes that it will encourage more research. We do have the platform to talk about it, so it, you know, I think it would be a disservice to the whole rare disease community to not to not talk about it. Hi, my name's Francis. This is my mom. As for Francis, Manville says she's still a bubbly, outgoing 12-year-old girl who loves to sing and dance. She even got a feature on the band's new album, where she sings things are gonna be just fine. We perform it and, you know, we sing those songs every night at the moment. Um, it's comforting to me. Addie Miners, WLKY News. Addie, thank you, and we'll have more information on our website about Portugal the Man's efforts to raise awareness.